see how long this one. Hey guys, it's your girl Nicola Dickens from Free My Cure. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel, whichever the case may be. So I thoroughly, thoroughly embarrassed myself a few minutes ago trying to stop a, a gentleman and his grandson from entering this little area because I'm getting ready to do an actual review. And I'm like, I don't want him to see what I'm doing because, you know, and so I'm finally like, I just sound too cryptic. It's just weird. I'm like, I do a cancer and cannabis show and I just don't want your son to see it. <laughs> so that is what happened. Good boy. Lay down right here. Come lay down with mama. You lay down too. Lay down. Not a boy. So we are back. We are here today. We will be reviewing um, lemon Voltan. It is a it is a 50/50 a sativa leaning. Taker, get over here. Um, hybrid. Um, they say it's, it is a sativa. It is not a pure sativa, but it is a hybrid of sorts. But it leans very sativa e. So let's go ahead and heat up this banger. Stop. Stop. I know you're not the main focus of this video and you don't like it, do you? I know. What the hell? <laughs> so let's go ahead and get this going. I want to. We're going to go ahead and heat this up. We're going to do the first one. Then we're going to kind of do this a little backwards today. Um, so we've been doing really good. I have a Tigger over here doing security right now, which is amazing. <laughs> Come sit down, Tigger. Tigger, come. He's like, I got it, Mom. I got it. I'll take care of everybody. So we are, we are kind of back. I uh, ended up having uh, found some venom extracts that I'm like, you know, something great deal. We are going to go ahead and we are going to roll with this. Went to the Cottonwood uh, Harvest, and I forgot the bag. I was like trying to think, did I bring it? Did I not? You know that wonderful, beautiful yellow bag that gets those salivary glands just to go in every time you pick that bag up. So today is a sativa leaning lemon Volcon, which is kind of a a um, designer of sorts of cannabis. But we will get into that as soon as we give this baby a good taste. So Don is almost a week out of surgery with his knee. He's doing really well. He is hobbling around, doing pretty good. He's doing better than what I will be. So I decided I'm gonna let him sleep a little bit. So we came out here to the river to do a nice little beautiful review just because it is actually super, super gorgeous out here. Plus, I wanted to tell everybody happy Thanksgiving. You know, uh, one of the things that I tried to do up until now was always make sure I came out on holidays and you know told you guys everything that was going on but today I think I just want to say how grateful I am that the sun is shining that the birds are chirping and that the water is rolling because it is absolutely spectacular out here it's so pretty okay I'm not two people doing this today so I'm gonna cut that back a little Tigger get over here so as always guys fuck cancer fuck anxiety fuck depression in with the good and out with the bad so this beautiful thanksgiving day recreational cannabis has passed in the state of Arizona. It is a beautiful day. I am out here sitting at this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful river, enjoying the beautiful sky. I'm listening to you whine, because you want to be let go so you can go play. So, Mr. Man over here, Get back. Get back. Mr. Mr. Raffy Man over here decided he was going to try to play with a new little friend. Only this little friend was this little bitty little guy. And he wanted to get him and play with him. And I'm not letting that happen. So I had to chase his little butt down. Almost had to tackle him. 
So he is now on uh, on leash law. That's what happens when 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 the husky Malamute decides to screw up, huh, Mister? So let's jump into this beautiful, beautiful stuff. At the very end, I will make sure to show you all of these things. Right now, let me tell you this gorgeous, gorgeous harvest deal that I got. Uh, it was five grams of shatter venom extract shatter for eighty dollars. I actually had points at harvest. So I used those points. I ended up walking out of the store with five grams of this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful shatter for 70 bucks. I was so happy. And that was with tax and everything. So I was extremely happy. I, I, I got my deal of the day. So I'm like, okay, I can go home now. So this is a lemon Voltan. It is a 50-50 hybrid. It is a phenotype of OG Kush. So we're going to start getting into some phenotypes here over the next couple of weeks. As I told you guys, um, maybe I am back full-time now. I haven't decided. I don't know yet. We, we might be back full-time. I would love to be back full-time as long as everything pans the way it's supposed to be. I am back full-time. Um, we will be, we're in Camp Verde right now. So we came to the harvest of Cottonwood. So shout out Cottonwood, beautiful store, loves being there, great deals. Uh, your people, great, great, great people. There's glassware here, mister. Think about it. You know your mama's gonna get mad if you drop the bomb. So, let's jump into this bad boy. He's got security down. <laughs> Tigger, stop, stop. Okay, so this is a thick snap and pull. It's kind of a yellow greenish clear snap and pull. Nobody really wants to look. sit down, Tigger. Nobody wants to look at your butt. Nobody. Nobody. Um, this is from Venom Extracts. It has between a 16 and 19% THC level. Um, this is some pretty good stuff. It's got a herbally, um, sweet, vanilla, nutty woody type of a flavor to it. It does have that pungency that's going to hit in the back of your throat. It has that spice to it. Overall, really good. A great, great designer for a holiday of all time. So, it's a Siva, Sativa Leaning Hybrid, sort of named for a designer Louis Vuitton, and packs a totally euphoric high that will have you, that will have you feeling insanely happy and lifted for hours on end and that's for what we need on a holiday holiday finally one of them sat down so the effects of this are calming euphoria hungry relaxing and uplifting medicinally uh appetite loss chronic pain cramps muscle spasms and stress so overall really good body and mind so we're going to do this one last time and then I'm going to jump up. I will show you what we're working with. Tigger, stay. Hopefully I don't get walked in on and I can get off of here before anybody notices that I am smoking pot right now. But that's what we do, isn't it? Guys, who wouldn't want to smoke pot right here? It is amazing. It's so beautiful. So right up the way a little bit is these little rapids and then right up further from that is um is this cute little waterfall um i put it i showed it to you guys with the walking of my dogs while i was scouting for a place um while i was scouting for a place it would be pretty that i could get the river in and we could you know do a good video with sometimes you gotta beat up things to make them work correctly. So, oh, this is a good day. So, I hope you guys have beautiful plans. Don't forget to always remember your wonderful veterans out there. I love you guys. Holidays are some of the worst times. So, remember, just if you see a veteran on, on holidays, you know, just give them a quick moment of your time, thank them for their service, and lift their spirits just a little bit, because holidays are a tough time for them. Um, at least always was for my brother. So, I just, you know, it's always sometimes I want to make sure that I talk to him on that, you know, on holidays to make sure that he stays in, in good spirits type of a thing. And I hope all of your families are having beautiful, beautiful days. I hope the turkey turns out amazing. I hope your holiday spirit stays bright. 
And no matter who in the hell you voted for, I love you. I love you for being here. I love you for being, you know, who you are. You are a great part of the day for me. And um, I missed you guys. I really missed you guys. So I am in better, you know, mental health spirit. So that is good. Um, we are in a much better place now. Um, we still have quite a bit of warranty stuff that we have to deal with with our trailer that was just totally disheartening over the summer. That was just, oh my God, I can't believe there's, I mean, we have a wiring problem. And I'm like, this is a brand new trailer. How do you have a wiring problem in a brand new trailer? And then, oh my God, it has just been, I am so happy to be back. <laughs> So as always guys, fuck cancer, fuck anxiety, fuck depression, in with the good and out with the bad. kind of hit me right here you get this I mean like sudden hit of euphoria um take her back here your body starts to relax it's like this blanket coming over you to relax your entire body this one's supposed to be extremely good for muscle spasms um I have had been having the time of my life with my bladder lately so not in a good way um so and I don't know if it's just the stress and the nerves of Oh my god the surgery is coming up or what exactly it is but you know hey it's you know it's getting there or if it's looking through all the properties and going okay which one which one so we are still trying to nail down that perfect piece of property tigger that's what happens when you take off how do you like it hmm? how do you like it <laughs> not talking to me so oh my goodness <clears throat> hit you right here so um, all week I've been kind of high last night I didn't sleep so well I'm hoping to be able to go back and take a nap so um, my pain levels have been higher than normal you know back to the eights eights and a half eight and a half type of, of levels so I'm hoping to go home, relax a little bit, unwind a little bit more, maybe smoke another time, and then take a nap to relieve the pain a little bit more. Um, but I want to say I can already start feeling it. My bladder, the top part of the bladder has started to relax down. Um, I don't have that, that constant like heart throb. Like when you have a lot of swelling going on in, in, in the bladder, you can feel every time your your heart beats, you can feel it throb in, in like the lining of your bladder. It is, it is extremely weird. It is horribly feeling and it'll make you jump. So it really kind of sucks. Tigger, stay here. No swimming. I know you like it. So um, I want to say that I'm probably down to about a seven right now. I'll pack everything up and get it back into the house. By then it'll start relaxing me a little bit more. Um, so usually with something like this, it, it'll take my pain down to about a, a six for about 45 minutes, at least enough for me to be able to fall asleep and kind of relax out the rest of the way. As long as I don't have a nightmare or something, then I normally do pretty good and I wake up well and, and then you see how the afternoon goes. <laughs> Um, but overall, this has been a great day. Thanks, guys, for joining me. Mwah. Love you madly. I hope you guys have beautiful Thanksgivings with your family. Mad love. Don't knock over the bong. To all of you, mwah. mad love. And I will see you guys back tomorrow. Oh, now you want... Now, you're getting me wet. What is it that you... You know the goodbye. You always know that you come over here and you sit on mama for the goodbye. How do you know that? How do you know that? How do you, how do you know to do that? I didn't even train you. You just, you got me wet. Oh, you suck. Ugh.
So let's see if I can get up. Okay, this is the fun part because now I gotta get him around the bong and then back around without knocking the bong over. And I am notorious for like breaking things. So I'm gonna take it with me and watch me trip and break it that way. I'm not going anywhere. Stop! There is the concentrate. Beautiful. Have a great day, guys.